Good morning, my dear children. Welcome all to the math class. Have you done the homework? Yes. You all wrote the number names in your notebook. Isn't it? Yes, I know that. Okay. What we have learned in the last class? We have learned to write the number names of four digit numbers. Isn't it? Yes. Is it easy to read the four digit numbers? Easy to write the number names? Yes, it is very easy because we know the place names. Already we have learned the five place names. Using the place name, we can write the number names. Very easy. Easily. Okay. In the last class, we learned to write the number names 1000 to 5000. Okay. Let's continue the numbers from 5000 to 10,000. Okay. Are you ready? Yes. So read these numbers along with me. Okay. Okay, read this number. How will you read this number? If you have any confusion for reading this number, just note down the place name. Just above the number, you can note down the place names. So, this is ones, tens, hundreds and thousand. Okay, then we can easily read the num number name. The number is 6000. Then, what about the next number? It is 0. The 100 place is 0. So, no need of reading that number. 0, 100. It's wrong. Okay. Don't read it as 0, 100. Just leave that place. Then read the next number. Okay. If 0 comes, just leave that place and read the next number. So, here the number is 6,010. 6,010. Okay, the next number. What's the number? Yes, it is 7400. Then the last number. I already told you, read the last two places together. So this is 50. 7400. And 50. Here and comes after 100. Okay. And is must. Then. Can you read this number? Yes. It's a fancy number. So read it. Loudly. 8,880. 8,880. Okay. What's the number? Yes, read it. Very easy. Fourth place is here and one place is here. So read it. Just read that place only. These two numbers are zero. Hundred place and ten place are zero. So no need of reading that number. Just read these two places. That is nine thousand and and nine. Now you all clear. Okay, how to write the number names? Okay. What's the number? Can you read this number? This is the biggest last four digit number. Biggest four digit number. Nine, 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 nine. All are nines. It is the biggest Four digit number. Okay, read this number. Yes. Nine thousand. Nine hundred. And ninety-nine. Yes. Nine thousand. Nine hundred. And ninety-nine. Okay. Then what is the next number? Any idea? 
What's the next number? 9,999. 9,999 is the biggest four digit number. How will you make the next number? Yes, we know how to make the numbers. When we add 1 to this number, we will get the next number. Okay, just check it. When just add 1 to this number. What will be the next number? Okay, 9 plus 1. 9 plus 1 is 10. Okay, all of you know it is 10. So, we wrote here 0. Then 10. 1 is balanced. That carry over to the next number. Isn't it? Yes. So, 9 plus 1. Again, 9 plus 1. 10 comes. So, again we wrote 9 here. That one. Carry over to the next place. Yes. Then again 9 plus 1. 10. It's carry over the 1. Then 9 plus 1 last. 10. Can you read this number? What's the number? How many digits are here? Yes. It has 5 digits. And Five places. Which are the five places? Ones, tens, hundreds, thousand. And the fifth place? Yes, ten thousand. Okay, then we can read this as. Okay, read the thousand together. Two thousands are here. This is, this is thousand and this is ten thousand. So you can read that thousands together. Okay, just. This is ones, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand. T T H T T H. That is ten thousand. So you can read this number together. Thousand group. These two numbers are in thousand group. So you can read that number together. So it is ten. Ten. Their place name is thousand. So the number is. 10,000. Okay. The 5 digit number. The first 5 digit number. Or the smallest 5 digit number is 10,000. Okay. The first 5 digit number is 10,000. 10,000. This way we can read the next thousands also. Okay, 10,000. The next thousand is 11,000, 12,000, 20,000, 40,000, up to how many thousands are there? Yes. We know that there are 99 thousands. Okay, so in this way we can read all the thousands. Okay, in this class, you have to learn the numbers from 1000 to 10,000 only. Okay. In the next class, you will learn the higher numbers. Okay. Next numbers you will learn in the next class. That means in your fourth standard. In this standard, you have to learn the numbers. You have to write the numbers and read the numbers from 1000 to 10,000 only. Okay. Clear? Yes. Now, today we are going to discuss the topic. Another topic that is place value. Place value. Not place name. Already we know the place name. Here we are discussing the place value. Each place has its value. Okay. Let's discuss the place value. Listen. For that, let's draw the place value chart. Already we know the places. So, draw, just draw the place value chart. Just draw a column like this. Now, note down each places. Okay. We know that the first place. Which is the first place? Ones. Second place? Tens. Then third place. Hundreds. And the fourth place. Thousands. And the fourth place is. Yes. 
it is ten thousands. So this is a place value chart. Okay, five places are shown here. Okay, ones, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand. Okay, each place has its own value. Okay, so what's the number? This is four. How many places are here? It has only one place. Which is that place? Ones. So what is the value of that place? Here the number is four. So its place value is four itself. So the place value of one is one. So four into one. Ones equal to four. So the place value of that number four is four itself. So the value of ones is one is here. Okay. The value of one is one. Place value of one. One's place value is one. Okay. Then second place. Tens place. Okay. Just look at this example. What's the number? Yes. It is 23. How many digits are there here? Two digits. Two places. The places are ones and tens. Okay. What is the tens place number here? Tens place number. It is two. The tens place number is two. Yes. Then what's that place? Tens place. So two into ten equal to twenty is the place value of two. That place value of two is twenty. Okay. This is the place value. Here the number is 2 and its place is 10. 10 means 10 itself into 10. So 2 into 10, 20 is the place value. Second place, place value is 10. 10. Okay. Like third place, 100. What is the place value? 100. Then 1000. Then 10,000. Okay, these are the place values. Okay, another example. Look at this. Here is a four digit number. 2,344. The number is 2,345. Isn't it? Yes. Can you tell the place value of each number? Yes, from the name we can get the place value. What is the place value of 3 here? Place value, not place. I am not asking the place name. Place name is 100. Okay. What is the value of that place? Yes, the place value of 3 is place value of 3. 3 is in 100 place. So 100 is the place value and 3 is the so the place value of 3 is 300. 3 into 100, it is 300. Clear? That way you will find out the place value. Okay. 3 is in 100 place. So the place value is 300. 3 is there and the place is 100. So 3 into 100 300 is the place value. Then what is the place value of 4 here? The place value of 4. What is the place value of 4? Yes. Tell me the place value of 4. What is the place value? Yes. Here 4 is in the 10th place. And we know the 10th place value is 10. It's a Okay, so what is the value? 4 times 10. 4 into 10. What is it? Yes, 4 into 10 is 40. So the place value of 4 is here. 4 is here. 40 is the second place, 10th place. So its value is 40. Then what is the place value of 5 here? Yes, 5 is in the first place, 1's place. 
So what is the value? It is not 1. 1. What is the value? The value is 5 because there are 5 ones. 5 is the number there. Clear? So the place value of this number is 5 ones. That is 5. 5 into 1, 5 itself. Clear? Place value of 5 equal to 5 into 1. 5 times 1. That is 5 itself. Clear? Then what about the place value of 2? Yes, 2 is in which place? It is in the 1000 place. So the value is the 1000 and the number is 2. So what is the value 2? 2 into 1000 equal to 2000. 2000 is the place value of 2. That is the value. Okay, clear? This is very simple. Nothing. First place value is that number itself. 5 itself. Place value of 5 is 5 itself. Then place value of 4 is? It is in 10th place. So the value is 40. 4 into 10. 40. Now place value of 3 is? 3 into 100. 300. Like place value of 2 is? 2 into 1000. 2000. Clear? Okay. Let me show you one more example. Okay, look at the number. Eight thousand three hundred and twenty-four. Isn't it? This number is eight thousand three hundred and twenty-four. Okay. What is the place value of 2 here. What is the place value of 2? Yes. The place value of 2 is here. Just count the place. It is in the tenth place. When we read this number it is 8324. Not 24. It is 24. It is in tenth place. So the place value of 2 equal to 20. 20 tens place. Okay, clear. Now what is the place value of 8 here? Yes, it is in the fourth place. And we read it as 8000. That is the place. So the place value of 8 is place value of 8 is 8000. Now what is the place value of 4? Yes, it is in the ones place. Ones place the value is 1 itself. So the, here is the number 4. Here the number is 4. So place value of 4 is 4. The same number, no change. Okay. And the place value of 3 is here. 3. 3 is in 100 place. So its place value is just add 2 zeros. 100, 400. You can add 2 zeros. That is the easy way to get the place value. If it is one place, the same number will be the place value. Okay. If it is in the tens place, tens one zero. Add one zero here. If the number is in hundred place, you can add two zeros. Four hundred. Just add two zeros. And the number is in thousand place, you can add three zeros. Then you will get the place value. Clear? Okay. Yes. So, just go through it. I hmm? will give you some example questions. Try to do that in your notebook. Okay. Thank you. Have a nice day.